Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. And in today's video, we have this 2023 Lexus NX350. And we're gonna do the tail light tint installation for this vehicle. So as you can see, this is how it looks before doing the installation on the tail lights. And this is how it looks after the installation. So the tint has PPF properties, which means it will protect the lenses from yellowing over time, as well as protect it from any small scratches or any road debris that may hit the lens. If you like the product, link for the product will be in the description below. But with that being said, let's get started with the installation video. So the tools you need in order to install the tent kit will be slip solution, tack solution, a heat gun, squeegee, and a microfiber towel. And a step-by-step -step guide in order to create the two solutions will be in the description below. Okay, so before starting with the installation, we need to make sure we prep the tail lights. So to prep them, all you need to do is apply your slip solution onto the lenses. And with a clean microfiber towel, just make sure you start removing any contaminants that the tail light may have. So we're gonna start off by installing the middle section of the tail light first. So with this one, apply your slip solution onto the lens and slip solution onto the tint film. And with this one, put it on this section of the tail light first. That way we're able to start fixing it on this end. So we need to adjust it and align it to this section of the tail light. So make sure you align it to this end of the tail light first. So it should be roughly around there. Once we have it aligned here, we're going to apply tack solution and tack it down with our squeegee. So grab your tack solution and apply it onto the film and the lens. Make sure it's still aligned and then tack it down to secure it. And just make sure you give yourself in the material, cover the bottom and also on the top section of the racetrack here. Make sure it's secure before we continue on with the rest of the installation. So once it's secure, all we need to do is just lift the film and align it to the tail light here. And on this end here, we're going to need to stretch the film so it could reach it to the other side. So this is the piece we need to stretch. So in order to stretch the film, all we need to do is apply a slip solution behind the film and on the lens as well. Place it back down, make sure everything is still aligned. Make sure this area is dry. That way your hand doesn't slip when you're stretching the film. So dry the film here and start stretching the film. And if the solution does get dry, just reapply the slip solution in order to stretch the film. So stretch the film, make sure everything is still aligned until you reach it to this other edge here. And now we've stretched the film to reach it to this end. All we need to do now is secure this piece here and then apply tack solution everywhere else and work our way on securing the whole entire beam here. So apply tack solution underneath the film and on top. That way our squeegee is able to glide and help us tack down the film more faster. So if it shifted, just lift it and realign it and just tack it down. And after we secured this piece, we could work on securing the rest of the film. Okay, so now we focus on securing the rest of the film. So just apply tack solution and start removing any solution that's behind the film and just helping it tack down little by little. Okay, and once we finish securing this whole piece, the last thing to do would be applying tack solution once again, and this time applying heat just to help seal any edges that are still lifting. So for example here, just applying heat and helping it tack down on the edge here and anywhere else where you still see the film lifting. So tack solution, grab your heat gun and start adding heat. Okay, and then just make sure there's nothing else lifting. And then once you're done with this installation, we can move on with this other section here. So now we're doing this piece here. So with this one, we're just going to apply slip solution onto the lens and onto the film. And after that, we're going to align it right on the edge here. And once it's aligned, we're going to tack it down to secure this spot and work away to installing it and stretching it to this side. So slip solution, align it to this edge, align it here, right on the edge. Now that it's aligned, lift it and apply tack solution underneath and on top of the film. Hold it in position and with your squeegee, start tacking this section down. And right here, make sure it's still aligned. 
and just do a light stretch to cover this edge of the tail light here. So just do a small stretch and that should be good to cover everything. Apply tack solution on top of the film and we'll hold it in position with one hand and with the other one just start tagging it down. And then don't forget to squeegee down the top piece here. Clean off the surface of the tent just so we could see if there's any water bubbles behind the film. And if there isn't, then we did good in removing all of the solution. But if there is, just make sure you remove them before we seal it. Because once you seal it, you won't be able to remove any of the bubbles. So it looks like it's good. So now that we finished this piece, we can move on to this section of the tele. So we're going to focus on installing this piece. This one, since it is a flat area, it's just more of making sure it's aligned and tagging it down. So to align it, just apply slip solution on the lens and on the film and just make sure you're covering just the clearest part of the light here so this piece here so it should be like this make sure it's doing just the coverage of the light once you have it aligned lift the film carefully and apply tack solution so we can start tacking and securing the film down so hold it in position squeegee on one side and then tack down the other side and as always just remember to remove any solution that's behind the film Clean it to double check and see if there's any bubbles behind the film. And if there's not, then we're good to go. And now we're going to install the small curved piece that goes in this section here. So now we're going to work on this section of the tail light first. So with this one, we're going to apply slip solution to the lens and slip solution to the tent film. And with this one, we recommend starting from the top surface here first. So which would be this small area on the film. So make sure you align it right on the edge here and it should just fall flat right here. It's okay if it doesn't cover this section here because once we install this other piece here, it'll do a full coverage on the edge here. So first let's secure this spot. To secure it, apply tack solution, hold it in position and just tack it down, but make sure it's still aligned. So hold it and tack it down. Squeegee lightly. And with this one, we can apply a little bit of heat just to help the adhesive on the film activate faster because it is such a small surface to work with. We need to make sure this piece stays tacked down before we continue on with the rest. So apply a little bit of heat to help it tack down. Make sure it's tacked down and it doesn't move. And now it should be secured. If you try to move it, the film stays secured. So now we can move on with the rest of the installation. So with this one, we're just going to help the film align to this section of the curve first. So to help it, apply slip solution and just guide it with your finger and help it tack down. Apply tack solution here underneath the film just so we could help them with the tacking down process. All you need to do is just use your finger, help it tack down and that's pretty much it. And also just make sure it's still aligned. Just like that. And then the remaining piece, just lift it and do a light stretch in order to reach it to this edge. So just lift the film, apply slip solution, and then just stretch it and use your finger to tack it down. Make sure you're holding on to this section of the tail light on the curve because if we don't hold it and we stretch it, this is gonna lift. So as you can see, when I let go, I lift it. But to tack it back down, all you need to do is apply tack solution and just help it tack down with your finger. And a little bit of heat will help it tack down more faster. Just be careful not to burn your finger and that's pretty much it and you're just making sure you secure the film and then once it's secured you can move on with the next piece which would be this one here so once we have it secured you should be good to go so now we move on to this piece here so with this one apply slip solution to the lens and slip solution to the tint film place the film down and just make sure you align it so it should be aligned like this Make sure it's covering the top, it's aligned to the bottom, so it should be perfect like that. Just make sure, like I said, everything's aligned before you tack it down. Once you align it, you can start applying tack solution to help tack down the whole film. And then grab your squeegee, hold it in position with one hand, and with the other one, just start tagging it down. And then just make sure you remove all of the solution behind the film. And right here, just add a little bit of heat just to help it tack down around this curve here. So tack solution and heat. And just add heat on this section too, just to help it seal. Once the film is good and ready to go, we can move on to the last two pieces, which will be this one and this one here. So for these last two pieces, because the area is a flat surface to work with, you could install it by just 
applying it from one end. So let's say here, make sure it's aligned and just putting it and installing it like that. If you do do this method, that there's no air bubbles behind the film, and but afterwards we will need to apply a little bit of heat just to help the adhesive activate faster. But if you don't do this method, you could do the other method where you apply slip solution and tack solution, align it and tack it down. So you could do either or for these two. So I'll show you how to do the other option with this one. So with this one, the other method would be applying slip solution, like I mentioned. So just apply it on the lens and on the film. And it's just making sure you align it where it covers the red reflector of the tail light. So like that. And then just apply tack solution. And with your squeegee, start tacking the whole film down. So there's two methods to going about it. It just depends which one you prefer. They're both as effective, but it only works with flat surfaces, not with curved areas. Like let's say this one here or the beam here. This dry method only works on flat areas. And then just clean it off to ensure that there's no water bubbles for this one. And if there isn't, then you're good to go. And you finish with the whole installation. And now we just move on to post heating the whole film. So the last thing to do once you finish with the whole installation is to post heat the whole film. That way we remove any small fingers that are still around the tent. And also if the film is still lifting, we help it tack down with heat. So to post heat, just apply tack solution all around the film that we worked on. And we're gonna use our heat gun and our microfiber towel to help tack down the film and help the adhesive activate faster. And the microfiber towel will help us absorb any solution that's going to come from underneath the film. And then once you're done with this step, you're done with the installation. Okay, so that concludes the installation video for the tail light tents for the 2023 Lexus NX350. We hope that this video helped you guys out with the installation. If it did, don't forget to drop a like on the video. Make sure to subscribe and turn on that notification bell. That way you don't miss any upcoming installation videos. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next one.